How fight with monsters? You must be careful to not become a monster. And how look in the abyss? Must must know that the abyss stand back of him. Morality is it subjective or? Are there so many amoral people? Like Nietzsche. People who are looked too far in the abyss and therefore without proper because there are to only use proper for taking practices to do there become mad. No. Morality is not subject, if you ask me. Yes, I think there are many people who are delusional. But morality is in its essence not subjective. The ones who say this are pretty much mistaken, if you ask me. They are delusional. are in the world of Myra, like the Inuvis maybe want to say, delusions, dreams, fantasies, malice, is not evil or good, compassion is not evil or good, anything is just, just a, pers a question of perspective. No. Some acts are pure evil, some are acts of ego, and some are uh, uh, some are acts of compassion, and that they are evil, malice, inappropriate, or not evil or good or compassionable don't change it because they are accepted by people of a certain culture without thinking there are always full of wickedness Apathy or empathy, no matter if the majority of the people don't see it, if you are not a victim, and don't imagine it entirely from your point of view. Yeah. Because when you are not a victim, things look a lot different from that angle now, and you can easily de sensitize. Claim that your victims are not aware, not conscious, that they are just automatons, things, objects, tools, food, objects for pleasure or amusement. But when you are the victim, if you look it from the victim's point of view, it becomes pretty easy. Which is right or which is wrong. We must learn humility. And we must learn to think logical and decent. We must understand that one moral system don't use might make right as one basic for decision making. 
that means that the law are also open for criticism, just like any other entity. For example, the R laws that protect the animal agriculture and harass activists to filming in concentration camps that we show you from we call slaughterhouses because of our arrogant ego that don't allow us to see our own errors because we are fat, lazy, sloppy and we're judging anybody to be wrong but ourselves and we are wondering why our children have no respect for us and why they're doing criminal things you make your children what they are stop being a hypocrite and go with you because meat they eating comes from malice 100% from malice if you are not aware that you don't have to eat animal, pro animal body parts secretions and you don't have to wear leather, silk or fur to survive then you can only come to the conclusion that it comes from malice and if you say lions do no I must say you this you will nothing do anything else the lions do and the law don't say it is okay when you eat your children like lions do sometimes they do it for control of populations but the law of people don't take that as okay so, don't take your dietary advice from a lion, dumb people of the carnivore diet. How's brain fit in one cup of water, little cup of water, We you take your medicines in? So small is your brain. Because you are starving it, because the brain works for 100% on carbohydrates, glucose, not on not on fat or protein or ketones. Yes, it can work for a little bit on ketones, something like 25%. But. That means still that your brain works just for 25%. Yes, particularly if you are a long time carnivore psycho. Now, people, I don't give you good things for your bad habits. I give you bad things for your bad habits and good things for your good habits. I'm not a politician and I don't in here to win a con popularity contest. contest. I've been here to speak the truth. In contrary with a drama queen, Kim Star. I only want to create drama. I've been here to talk about the most biggest genocide ever committed by our species. Even most people don't maybe want to hear it or talk about it. Because it is so hard for the precious little egos. When vegans speak out against animal abuse, there are not the self-righteous people. There are the righteous people. Because they don't speak for themselves. They speak against injustice, they speak against systematic discrimination, hatred and brutality against innocent living beings who have harmed never one body in their whole entire life. 
the people how say um, I do cruel things uh, but I respect your life way of life so you do have to respect my way of life those people are delusional hypocritical and full of shit there are like that guy that say I'm a child abuser and I murder children and I use them in por child pornography but uh, do you think you, I don't force you to do the things I do so uh, don't be so negative Nancy <laughs> or I like Hitler I'll say or on the Nazi I'll say um, you in people out of England, I've heard all the things uh, that you say about us, and I will say they are maybe true, but there are things that are happening in our country. So respect the things happening in our country. Then we also respect the things you do in your country. That's hypocritical. That's malice. That comes from malice. Evil, psychopaths, malice, malice, malice. Again, if you are not a victim, don't imagine it entirely from your point of view. Because if you are not a victim, it becomes pretty easy to mock a victim, make fun of their entire existence, and label them stupid and dirty. Like we have done with blacks, with women, with homosexuals, with LCB people for so long time for so long so much generations it is time to step into reality kindness to all living beings is a mark of a civilized society dog fighting, cock fighting, speciesism Racism, sexism, heterosexism, misogyny, carnism, white supremacism, anthropocentrism, Yuan, Yuan Festival, Pig Fest, etc., are all signs of an uncivilized cult. Be careful for throwing stones in somebody's glass house. We vegans are not the violent one. That are you. If you are buying people to murder animals for food choices. What I call violations. Then you are not nothing be better than Charles Manson. Who also don't have kill people personally. But... He is uh, guilt. He, he was guilty of um, murder. It is called a murder by proxy. Proxy murder. Now, I don't hold ventures against people when they are chased, when they are going vegan, and so do the animals not. But I think. If you are deciding to become mortal consistent, and go vegan, the least you can do is try to let other people also to stop to being animal abusing succubuses and incubuses. And if there are not one to go vegan, don't waste your time anymore about on them and focus on people how listen. And cut people out of your life that are toxic. And maybe ruin, ruin their reputation maybe also. Destroy their complete reputation. If you can because vegans are the only ones who deserve a good reputation. 
because we are the ones that standing up against systematic oppression, even if it is not popular. Martin Luther King said say once, there is something so dear, there is something so precious, that it is worth dying for. And if you know how to find one thing where you are willing for, will, will be willing for to die, I say you, this person is not fit for life.